chances are, if you have visited Beijing, you've made a stop at the famous shopping venue called the Silk Market. It's known for its knockoff brand items. But as China News shows you, the general manager is now in trouble for allegedly selling counterfeit goods. A bustling bazaar of broken English bargaining and brand name knockoffs is in legal trouble. Friday, the Chaoyang District Procuratorate confirmed the arrest of Wang Jili, the former general manager of Beijing Silk Street Market. It said Wang, together with a security official and businessmen, invested 58,000 U.S. dollars at the end of 2007 to sell fake brand name bags bearing the Louis Vuitton trademark. Wang, who took the job in early 2006, left in July 2009. He was captured in December in Hohut, capital of the Inner Mongolia Autonomous Region. Prosecutors say, in addition to selling counterfeit goods, Wang also allegedly received more than $10,000 in bribes to get him to use underground storehouses for fake products from a businessman named Yang Chengjun. In January this year, police seized Yang's warehouse and found more than 8,000 fake brand name bags, such as Louis Vuitton and Chanel. The value is placed at $113,000 U.S. dollars. His case has been accepted by the district court. Throughout its history, the Silk Street Market has been controversial because of trademark infringements. However, it maintains popularity among consumers for its low prices, especially with foreigners. No specific court date has been released for either of the two men indicted.